19. That's how many bomb threats Onslow County Schools received last year. Each one put the school on lockdown and had teachers placing red or green cards in their windows, letting law enforcement know if there's a crisis or if everything's okay. So what happens is all of the green rooms are the safe rooms. The red room is the crisis situation. This year, they're doing things a little differently. Implementing a browser-based system teachers can access on their computer, tablet, or cell phone with a username and password. So what happens is you have the ability on your screen to choose a color status. You can go red, green, which is the standard FEMA colors. And we also have three other colors available to them for medical emergency or a crisis, missing student situation. Whenever a teacher changes their color code to red, whoever's up here in the front office will get a hold of them through instant message, make sure it's legitimate, then come over here, pull the panic button, and notify authorities. They've never even picked up the telephone and law enforcement is already on site. The system also sends law enforcement a color-coded map so they know exactly where the crisis is located before they even step foot on campus. Normally the process is just a long and drawn out process of have they called 911, have they called the district office. Now when that teacher presses red, I'm automatically notified. I'm already in route the same time police is in route. It's about cutting down response times, which can save lives. With you know, all the threats last year, a lot of questions were, what are you doing? This visually shows them this is what we're doing. In Onslow County, Amanda Wilcox, Time Warner Cable News.